to start. Oh, yeah. My name? It's Ethan. Ethan Winters. It's been three years since everything happened at the Baker House. I was looking for my wife, who disappeared. I got an email from her. She told me to come get her. And of course, that's how I ended up in the middle of nowhere, Louisiana. Meet the Barker. <laughs> or the I Baker. Found right? being held captive in a dark basement. She wasn't thinking right. She attacked me like some kind of wild animal. Cut your arm off. Later on, I found out that she was infected by a special kind of mold. I looked all over the house trying to find an antidote, a vaccine, anything. Well, there he is. <laughs> the people who lived there were already infected. What was left of them wasn't human. The source of the infection was a bioweapon that looked like a little girl. Her name was Evelyn. I fought the fucked up family and was able to treat Mia's symptoms with a serum. Ooh. Then Chris Redfield and his soldier buddy showed up. Chris. And saved the both of us. Is that enough? Oh, is he? I really don't want to talk about what happened anymore. Oh, he's probably had interrogation. It's all over now. I don't think so because this is a sequel. How's it going, everyone? I'm VTuber Vincent, and welcome to Resident Evil Village. I wanted to play this game for a long time, but never got the chance to. And I wanted to know the hype with uh, a certain character in this that I'm pretty sure everyone knows, Lady Dimitresk. Dimit. 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 The big boobed lady. You know what? Fuck it. We're going hardcore. Hell yeah. Village of Shadows. Ooh. Long ago, a young girl went with her mother to pick berries for her father, who was hard at work. But the forest greeted them with a dark, cold silence. The bushes empty. Yet determined to find it's the like berries, Tim the style. rascal broke free from Mother's grasp and vanished into the trees. Mother's worried cries faded fast as the girl ran on, over vine and under branch, and into the forest deep. Feeling strange eyes upon her, the girl recalled Us. Mother's scary bedtime tales, and her throat became bone dry. <laughs> then the Pat Lord appeared. He greeted her warmly and bit his own wing. Come, child, quench your thirst, he uh. said. So she drank the thick, dark blood and smiled with joy. Passing through the graveyard, menacing storm clouds loomed, and the air turned bitingly cold. The girl was shivering in her thin clothes. Then a dark weaver appeared, and with a click of his fingers, crafted mist into a beautiful dress. Come, child, warm yourself, he coaxed. So she clothed herself and smiled no, this looks with cool. joy. Well, Across fishies. waters deep and ominous she went. Ah, and no. a boat she found would carry her home. But hunger's grip tightened and her heart grew heavy. Then the fish king appeared what? and offered one of his many fins. Come, child, eat your fill. So the girl ate and smiled with joy once more. I don't think that would happen in real life. <laughs> she soon entered the forest's dark heart. Then an iron steed appeared, bearing a beautiful golden gear. The creature said nothing as the girl approached and snatched what she thought was another gift. The horse grew angry and summoned the other monsters. Terror filled the girl's heart as a wild wind rose around the beast. Suddenly, a witch appeared, dark yet regal. Ooh. Oh dear. Gifts we gave, but more you took, she snarled. Whoa. So more in turn is due. 
In a blink, the girl was trapped inside a mirror. Little baby. There. She's asleep. That's fucked up story. Is with the creepy story, she's only six months old. Exactly. <laughs> Woman at the store said it was traditional. A local tale. Really? Besides, Rose doesn't seem to mind. Because she doesn't understand it. Thank God. Yeah. <laughs> we moved here so that she wouldn't have to deal with any of that. Remember? There's nothing wrong with my memory. Oh. You're just being paranoid. It's not. Well, I can see she's touchy about that. Yeah. I'm sorry. But I'm not paranoid. I'm just cautious. Then, go cautiously take your daughter to bed. All right. What's her name? You stupid. I'll finish dinner. It's just daughter. God, she got some chubby cheeks. It's okay, Rose. R R I'm an idiot. They just said her name, and I immediately like, what's her name? Oh, this is my baby Rose. What's her Did name? Did you say something? Nothing. I'll put her down. Dude, the sensitivity for the mouse is... Shh, shh, shh. It's okay, it's okay. It's okay, little Rose. There it's okay. Go. It's like I said to your mom. That book's too scary for you. Yeah, like, you're gonna get some goddamn nightmares being eaten by a giant monster, and I don't want that for baby Rose. Almost there, honey. A picture of flowers, wow. Okay, apparently I have telekinesis. Wait, this is... Oh. <laughs> Here you go. There you go, sweetheart. Don't you worry. I'll be right downstairs. Daddy won't let those weird fairy tale monsters get you. And enjoy. What is. What are those? God, those look cheap as fuck. Alright, time to get some sugar. What you cooking, honey? Game kind of froze for a sec. Is she okay? Sleeping like a... Ooh, that looks Sally good. Day. Oh, I'm hungry right now, actually. Oh, I gotta mm. pick something that up to good. eat after this. Oh, hands off, mister. Hmm. It's chorba de legum. It's what? a local recipe. Wow, you've gone full native, haven't you? Mm. Local wine, too. Ooh. But if you're gonna keep sulking all evening, maybe you shouldn't have any. You really have to stop worrying. It's just finding you in Louisiana, the pregnancy, Chris moving us here, military training, it all happened so fast. What? You know? Well, at least we're all together. Military training? You, me, Rose. Good drink. Now, everything's gonna Seriously, be- Seriously, think we can just forget about what happened in Louisiana? It happened so long ago. I just, I don't understand why you are so- Oh! Mia, get down! Mia! Oh my god! No! Mia, oh god! Why? Who the f- Chris? What the hell? Sorry, Ethan. He's about to move. No! no! Oh my god! What? What? Why? Why did you- Are you serious? That's how we're gonna open this? Oh my god! Go on, move! What the f- uh, no, don't touch Rose! Rose? Don't you- What the hell are you doing with my daughter? Package secure, sir. Package! You f Take him away. I said get your hands off her! Ethan, no. What do you mean, no? You shot my wife! And you're kidnapping my kid! Rose? Get him out of here. You son of a bitch, Chris. 
I'm I'm so shocked. I'm really <laughs> that fucking I can't believe that. That whole game saving her and she gets gunned down. Hey Doc. Hey, Doc. Hello, Mr. Winters. I've got your daughter's results back and I'd like you to come in to talk about them. How about the next Thursday four o'clock? No problem. No problem. We'll be, we'll be there. That was the that doc. Was doc. She'll see us next week. Dude, I don't know. Ugh. I can't yeah. even watch this scene right now, dude. Sense. That's fucked right. up. We talked, we talked about, about this. this. I know. I know. We hardly we talk about anything else. I, I keep telling you, it's not Rose that I'm worried about. Well, then what are you worried about? <sighs> Look. Look. She's gonna be fine. I just know it. What else matters? We matter, Ethan. You matter. You just me. What are you talking about? Is there something you're not telling me? Come on, talk to me. Damn it. I have to take this. I'm actually really depressed by that, though, man. My little... <laughs> Dude, that really fucked me. God damn it. How she got shot and just, like, just shocked in it and... what, Dude, if she... I, I do gotta say, if you got shot in the shoulder and not get pushed back by the momentum... You should fucking duck. But she just got lasered. Why did he even have to kill her? Like, what the hell? He let... He let me live! Why the fuck did he kill her? That makes no sense. About damn time. What's your status? Package oh shit. What are you talking about? Where's Chris Redfield? And Rose? Who is this? This is a secure channel. You are not off the earth. Oh. Fuck. Someone took Rose, I bet. That wasn't the government. What the hell happened to you? Or whoever the hell those assholes are. Oh, the game just froze. Oh, there we go. Useless. Dead guy there. What is this? Mission objectives. Eliminate target. Recover body. Security. Rosemary Winters and Ethan. Oh my god. They uh, killed her and recover. Oh my god. Move the two witnesses to site C for further investigation. At least two transport officers to accompany them. Looks like you needed fucking more. God damn it. I might switch to controller because it it's just feels so slow. And oh, that's me. Where do I go? There. It's dark. <sighs> Any bears out here? I don't want any bears sticking their willy in me. Follow the white snow road. Okay, that was comp that was definitely something else. That was not me. She's taking a fancy walk. How do I? C C is to crouch. Ooh. Yeah, I might just get a controller in in a bit. Maybe next episode. Yeah, something's following me. What did it say? Crouch while standing? I my game just froze. Ah! Oh! Rocks. Hard for me to see, man. I don't know where I'm going. 
Oh, that's... Okay, dead birds everywhere. Oh! Oh my god. Oh my god, I... Ah, fuck! <laughs> Got scared by a goddamn bird. Do it! Yep, yeah, sorry for you. Oh god, something just finished it. I'm I gotta go. <sighs> Small bridge. Why does my game keep freezing a bit? What's in here? Probably take that ring off, cause I'm just saying though. No. Right, let's see. What's in here? Ah, great! A backup plan. That's someone. Who's there? Oh, I wonder what this is a callback to. Garlic. Jesus. Wait, what the? What is this? All right. Jesus. Okay, well, okay, let's get face full of death, right? Or not, that's right. Hang on. I'm gonna turn around and there's gonna be something behind me, isn't it? Something's gonna come at me. I knew it! I don't know where to go. I don't know where to go. Uh, I can't see. Like, at all, man. Oh, that's great. Well, something or someone's here. Ew. How'd I cut my hand? Ooh. What did all this? Why did it do this? He walk on Walked on in and just said, F you. You climb over. In other words, walk forward. This is pretty. <clears throat> still wanna know why he just shot my wife like that. That still pisses me off, man. I'm just for whoa. Where the hell am I? Holy shit! 